It's exciting when a new electric car shows up. How about an entirely new brand? That's what this is. I'm Tom Volk for the Seattle International Auto Show Online, and this is the Polestar 2. A joint venture between Volvo and its parent company, Geely, the two shares an architecture with the Volvo XC40 Recharge EV. It has a range of 233 miles and some interesting tech. I remember some 15 years ago when push button start was new, it seemed almost magical. The Polestar 2 doesn't have a button. You just sit down and the car starts. So in effect, your butt is the button. Like most EVs, no transmission, the drive selector has a sure feel. And it's quick, sprinting to 60 miles an hour in just over four seconds. The twin motor, all-wheel drive setup makes 408 horsepower. This is an electric vehicle. The batteries are in the floor. The center of gravity is very low, so it whips around corners with no issues at all. It's fun and engaging. Polestar 2's chassis is steel girder solid, and since it's related to Volvo, stuffed with active safety features like automatic emergency braking. The interior envelops the front occupants with materials that are solid and rich. Reclaimed wood is part of Polestar's sustainability mission. The interface is the first to run Android Automotive OS and might be the best I've experienced. Okay, Google, I need to go to Costco. Especially the voice recognition system. The one on 4th Avenue South is 6.1 miles away. Polestar 2 seats five. The cargo space of this hatchback is very useful with a lot of features not found on other vehicles. There's 14.2 cubic feet with the backs up or nearly 39 with them folded. Polestar has just announced a charging alliance with ChargePoint. This EV is well worth checking out. Polestar spaces, where the cars can be seen, are just now popping up throughout the US. Seattle will get one in the spring of 2021. For the Seattle International Auto Show Online, I'm Tom Volk.